What's up guys, Chicks here from Chicks Tech Reviews. Welcome to the coolest tech of the month, February 2021, episode 53. Now, I'm not going to lie, this video concept is an absolute mission to put together and takes quite a few days of planning, recording, editing, but I always end up doing it. And one reason is my passion for trying out different tech. And the other reason is, of course, the people. So this is episode 53, bringing you another collection of cool and unique tech products and everything you're about to see will be linked in the description box and I will also include the timestamps so you can jump straight to the product that interests you. Now, if you missed any of the previous episodes, I will leave the entire playlist in the description box. Meanwhile, if you want your product featured, just go ahead and send me an email. So without any further ado, let's begin with the first cool product. You are looking at an all-in-one mobile filmmaking kit and I have two versions here, one for USB-C devices and the other one is for iOS devices. So here is the content of both kits and you are getting exactly the same accessories. So here is two examples. On the right we have the iPhone 11 Pro Max and on the left we have the Huawei Mate 40 Pro. Both of these are quite large smartphones and you can see this vlogging kit easily holds them securely in place. They're not going anywhere. We've got the microphones attached and we've got the lights as well. So take your vlogging to another level with better audio, better lighting and with the added versatility of having tripod legs. Now, I personally love shooting YouTube videos with my phone. It's just more convenient than a full size camera. So the brand new vlogger kits by Rode. I'd like to give a big shout out to Rode for hooking me up with these awesome vlogger kits. I'm definitely going to be making use of these. Definitely check these out, people. And guess what? This entire video that you are currently watching is actually being shot on the iPhone 12 Pro Max. So next up, we have the Drop Labs EP01 Haptic Feedback Sneakers or Trainers, as we like to call it in the UK. Now, I've actually already done a full detailed review and demonstration of this product, but I do still want to give it a quick mention in this Coolest Tech special. And in case you haven't seen that video, I'm just going to run a few highlights on the screen. So that was the Drop Labs EP01 haptic shoes. If you do want to see my full detailed review, do check out the links in the description box below. So here we have the Red Magic Cyberpods. So these are true wireless stereo Bluetooth gaming earbuds with a futuristic cyberpunk LED design. So that looks really nice, as you can see. Now on the back, we've got a USB-C charging port. Now let's quickly take them out. So let's take a closer look at the earbuds themselves. So earbuds are made from plastic. You've got these LED changing lights. Now they do have touch control. They feature Bluetooth version five. You've got eight millimeter dynamic drivers. You have a dedicated gaming mode, giving you 39 millisecond of low latency. And you can switch between gaming and music mode by simply tapping the right earbud three times. Now you've got automatic connections with Red Magic phones. You've got atmospheric lighting effects, touch control, and each earbud will give you four hours of battery life with an additional 15 hours with the charging case. And you can pick up the Cyberpods for under $50. And I do like the futuristic design with the cyberpunk lights on the front. Check this out, people. This is the Pro V gaming headset by Sahara Gaming. So these are full-sized gaming headphones. You have 57 millimeter drivers. They're made from a combination of plastic and metal and covered in this soft leather-like material. Now they are well padded in the ear cups and the headband on both sides. And they are also covered in that leathery soft material. And you've got the Sahara Gaming engraved on top. So very well made indeed. They look ultra comfortable. And they come with a durable braided cable. It uses standard 3.5 millimeter jack. That's going to be compatible with your PCs, laptops, Macs, game consoles, tablets, smartphones, etc. And the USB is totally optional. And when you plug that into a source, it, and what that will give you is the blue LED lights. 
If you don't plug that into any power source, the headphones will still work with the audio jack connection. Um, the USB is only for the LED lights, which I must say do look really nice. An affordable gaming headset by Sahara Gaming. These are the Pro V. Definitely check these out, people. So the next cool product to make a debut on our list is the brand new Superbox Elite. So here is the new version of the Superbox. And if you follow the channel, you'll know exactly what this box is about. I'll quickly go through what's new. The housing is made completely from metal um, instead of plastic, which keeps the box from overheating. You've got a physical power button and an LED display. And not only that, you've got dual antennas for a better Wi-Fi connection. So you can quickly have a look at all the ports. You do have SBDIF. That's actually a 100 megabyte LAN. HDMI out. And on the side, you've got one USB 2, one USB 3, and a micro SD card slot. So what else does the new Elite model have? Well, you've got upgraded specs. So we've got the S912 octa-core CPU with the Mali 720. You've got four gigs of RAM and 32 gigs of eMMC internal storage. This box is running full Android version 9. So this is an all-in-one streaming box. You're buying not just a box, but also a service that allows you to basically cut the cord. There is no info on how long the service will last, but you do get a one-year warranty with the box. So that's a guarantee of one-year service for the price you pay and you've got a full featured remote control now i've already done full reviews on the previous superbox models i believe there are a few more added apps in there the basic software is exactly the same i believe you've got an upgraded epg and you've got some few extra apps added in this model but other than that you can expect the same type of service so if you want more information on the superbox um, check out the links in the description or check out any of my previous superbox videos and that will give you a good idea uh, of what to expect. Um, definitely liking the look and design, but although it does have quite a hefty price tag. So that was the Superbox Elite, people. Now here we have a brand new budget 4K action camera by 8man. So this is the A87. So you get a handy zip up hard case included. And that holds your camera, the two batteries and all the accessories nice and neat i'm not going to take everything out but i will show you the important bits of course the camera two batteries and i'll show you the capacities we have two 1050 milliamp hour batteries included there is also a remote control and a whole bunch of useful accessories to keep you busy the camera is housed inside this waterproof case now with the case on you'll be able to go 40 meters underwater and here is the action camera itself. So you can see the ports on the side, including micro SD card slot, a shutter button and a light power button on the front. We've got an up and down navigation button and the top button will also activate your Wi-Fi. So this is 4K at 60 frames per second with image stabilization on. And this is daytime footage. 4K60. Switching to 4K at 30 frames per second with image stabilization on. So that was the affordable 8-man A87 4K action camera, but video quality and photos not bad for the price. So you're looking at Edifier's brand new bookshelf speakers. These are the R1700BT and here they are. So really beautifully designed bookshelf speakers finished in brown. You've got some controls on the side for treble, bass and master volume. And on the back, you've got your physical power switch and you've got your auxiliary in, PC in, and your left speaker out, along with your power cable. You'll find some spare audio cables and a tiny remote control. Check that out, people. 
Now let's have a closer look at the speakers themselves. If I remove one of the grills. Now the speaker itself consists of a 19 millimeter silk dome tweeter, and you also have a four inch woofer and both speakers giving you a maximum of 66 watts RMS. And you do have a subwoofer connection on the back. So let's give these a very quick sound test. sound for the price great build quality and you've got a really nice design and finish which will complement most setups the edifier r1700 bt um, excellent quality bluetooth speakers especially for such a low price and i've always been a fan of edifier products because they're just top quality and they also offer that great two-year peace of mind guarantee so you're always getting your money's worth with this brand so yeah definitely check them out now here we have the Makalu 67 Professional Gaming Mouse. Now, interesting box, reach your summit. That's uh, more information on the specs. You can pause the video if you want some detailed info. There you can see lightweight RGB gaming mouse Makalu 67. And here you've got more features on the back. So this is quite a feature packed product. I'm gonna take it out of the box to show you innovation performance, aesthetics, and customization. So this product is the first ever mouse with the PAW3370 sensor. It's unbelievably light for a full-size mouse. Now this is an optical mouse. You've got your standard left and right. You've got a button over here, two buttons on the side, and you've got your a really nice and smooth scroller. Now, this offers adjustable DPI between 100 to 19,000 DPI, giving you precision accuracy that you need for gaming. Now, I really like the rib cage see-through design. It means it's going to be airy on your wrist. Um, you're not going to get too hot or sweaty on your palms. You've got this gold-plated USB and a braided USB cable. So everything feels well-made and designed to last. And if you have a look at this very attractive looking LED ring, you have individual RGB lighting for each of the eight LEDs in the ring. So that means you can customize the colors to suit your preference. And you have some great software to go with it called Basecamp, which allows you to manage and customize the features of the mouse, which includes macro editor, custom keys, RGBs and firmware updates. So if you're looking for a lightweight, accurate gaming mouse with adjustable DPI, then definitely consider the Makalu 67 gaming mouse, people. Now this is the Movo UM700 Studio microphone. And here is the microphone. It's made completely from metal. You've got the Movo logo on the top, mute switch. You've got volume control for your headphones. And if I just flip this down, you can see your headphone jack and on the other side, you've got microphone gain and you've got adjustable pickup patterns. Now, what's special about this microphone is it reminds me a lot of the Blue Yeti X. So if I show you the Blue Yeti X side by side, check that out side by side. It's a very similar build quality, um, similar design, similar controls. You've got pickup patterns on the Yeti as well. Now, the Blue Yeti X is one of the best microphones I've ever tested. But the Movo UM700 is also pretty good and you are getting a professional studio quality microphone. So a decent alternative to the Blue Yeti X. And how can I say it's a decent alternative? Well, I've actually tested them both and I've done a comparison. Yes, the Blue Yeti X is slightly better, but nevertheless, I was still very impressed by the quality of the Movo UM700. So this is the Ecovax D-Bot Osmo 920. So this is a brand new robot vacuum cleaner. It's a two in one, so it can vacuum and mop at the same time. And this is your mop attachment. So when you've got this attached, it will know to vacuum first and then mop. Now over here, you've got your charging station. So when the vacuum cleaner is low on battery, it will automatically dock itself. 
Now this model has some brand new features, which includes multi-floor mapping, laser technology. You have visual boundary and carpet detection. So that means it's able to identify different carpets and floors and adjust the suction power accordingly. This technology comes in handy as it's able to avoid carpets whilst it's mopping. Okay, and if you lift this lid over here, you have your dust compartment. And here it is. So you press this button and you can empty the dust out with ease. And on top, you can see your filter. And this is a washable and reusable filter. And you have a spare one as well. Inside, you have your main power button and also a Wi-Fi button. So yes, you do have built-in Wi-Fi, so you can control this robot vacuum cleaner with your smartphone. And this also supports Google and Alexa voice control. Now you have a long battery life, so it will give you 110 minutes of cleaning time and it can automatically dock itself to the charger when the battery is low. So that was a very quick look at the Ecovacs D-Bot Osmo 920. Now here we have the Live All C20 Cycle Helmet. Last month's episode, I showed you the Live All BH-51M, but I accidentally called it the C20. So this is the actual Live All C20 cycle helmet. So very lightweight, durable, robust, and you have the same comfortable padding that you expect to find in the Live All brand. Now this helmet supports smart lighting. Now on the back, you've got brake warning lights, you've got your power button, and you've got your charger port. So just peel that section back and you will see your charger port. Now this helmet features fall detection, SOS alerts, automatic power on and off, it is compatible with Strava and iHealth. There is a Live All smartphone app to help you manage the features. And this charges via a USB magnetic cable. And the helmet's built-in battery will give you around 36 hours of battery life. And this helmet is IPX4 waterproof. So that was the affordable Live All C20 smart cycle helmet, people. So over here we have the Bowmaker PA sound system model Lark PA01. And here it is, an all-in-one PA sound system, which will give you up to 500 watts of power. And it's also quite light at only 5 kgs. So you've got your main carry handle and you've got some wheels at the bottom. And you've got this extendable handle. So you press the button, push it out, just like a regular suitcase. Now this speaker system consists of an 8-inch subwoofer and you have a 3-inch tweeter. You also have a built-in 2,200 milliamp hour lithium ion battery, which will give you eight hours of portable sounds on the go. Now you have six EQ modes built in. Now it does come with its own microphone and remote control. Power on. Now this unit does support multiple connections, including Bluetooth, 3.5 millimeter aux. You've got microphone and guitar connections and you have USB playback and a separate port to charge your devices. It's great to see manual control dials. You've got separate dials for your bass and treble, and then you've got your volume for your microphone, guitar, and echoes. Now this unit does have built-in FM radio and you can scan all your channels in. So let's test out the sounds. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Add some echoes, add some echoes. Yeah. So that was Bowmaker's new PA sound system, the Lark PA01. Definitely check this out, people. So brand new home security camera by Arenti. This is the Go One. So check out this brand new home security camera and it's a completely wire-free model and has a built-in 6,700 milliamp hour rechargeable battery. And this camera aims to give you up to 180 days of battery life on a full charge and of course that depends on the frequency of triggers. So it supports 1080p full HD with night vision you have a 165 degree wide angle lens. This supports micro SD cards up to 128 gigs. And you have optional cloud storage with three months trial included. There is a micro SD card pre-installed. It comes in the package and that is a 32 gig SanDisk. Now this camera is good for indoor and outdoor use and it is IP65 water resistant. It features AI powered human motion detection. 
You've got notification alerts, a built-in speaker and microphone for two-way conversation. And this also works with Alexa and Google voice control. Now you can manage all features and view the live feed from anywhere using the Arenti smartphone app. So an affordable wireless home security camera, no need to worry about your wiring and drilling extra holes. It comes with all the mounts and fixtures you're ever gonna need. And what I like about it is how small and compact it is. So that is the brand new home security camera by Arenti, the Go One. Now next on our list, we have the Lipertech Levy True Wireless Stereo Earbuds. So you get a charging case made completely from plastic. It supports wireless charging and you have USB-C charging at the bottom and it does support fast charging. And if we open up the case, you will see the earbuds if we take them out. So these are the Levy. Now, as you can see, the earbuds have a button on the side. So you've got button control and not touch control. Now they do support Bluetooth version five. They are true wireless stereo with MC sync technology. They are IPX5 waterproof and support ambient sound function. Now each earbud will give you eight hours of battery life and the charging case would give you an additional 40 hours. You can access your voice assistant directly from the earbuds and they do give you a pretty decent sound quality. Now they do support fast charging, so 15 minute charge in this case will give you two hours of non-stop music. So Lipertech's brand new True Wireless Stereo earbuds, giving you plenty of premium features for such a low price. So yeah, definitely check out the new Lipertech Levy. So we have here two brand new power banks by Orki. So one is small and compact, 10,000 milliamp hours, and the other one is a 20,000 milliamp hours. So first of all, let's check out the compact version. So the capacity is 10,000 milliamp hours. It supports power delivery three and quick charge three. You've got a button on top. When you press it, it will show you how much battery life you have left in the power bank. You've got a full size USB port on one side and you have a USB type C port, which supports both power delivery in and out. So maximum fast charging speed, 18 watts. So you can charge your iPhone 12 Pro from zero to 60 in just 30 minutes. Now quickly check out the new Pro model. Now this power bank also supports power delivery three and quick charge three, but you have a capacity of 20,000 milliamp hours. And also on top, you have a wireless charging pad and a flip out section. So you can have your power bag as a stand for your smartphone and also a charger at the same time. So this supports up to 10 watts wireless charging. On the side, we have a digital display. So when you press a button, it will show you how much battery you have left. And you can see that says 78%. You have a full size USB port and a USB type C, both power delivery in and out. On the other side, there is nothing and you have a kickstand at the bottom. Now this also supports a maximum 18 watts power delivery. So you can charge three devices at the same time, one wirelessly charging and the other two with wires. So massive capacity, great convenience. And I love the kickstand and wireless charging feature. And another plus point, which most of you might know already, you get 24 months warranty with all Orki products. So those were the affordable, but very good quality power banks by Orki. Now here is a very useful product. This is the CharWeGo 45 watt travel adapter. So first of all, it's a travel adapter. So you've got all the countries listed there. So worldwide compatibility with four built-in connectors. So you just push them out and then press the button on the side to push them back in. And I'll show you all of them. Now, even if you didn't use this for travel purposes, for example, I'm in the UK, so I could have it set on UK, but then it will give me the ability to charge six devices at the same time. You've got five USB ports on the top and you've got an additional AC socket. And you can see you've got worldwide compatibility with the AC sockets as well. Now this is powerful enough to charge your MacBook Pro and smartphone and tablet all at the same time. Now the USB-C port will give you a maximum power delivery of 45 watts and supports all the voltage in between from five volts, three amps onwards. And the USB-A ports support up to 12 watt max. And these are all smart ports, so it can detect in real time exactly how much voltage is needed for your device and supply it accordingly. Now the CharWeGo has all its safety protections in place. So you have your protections for over voltage, overcharging, short circuits, etc., And you have your international certifications for safe use. 
So awesome price for an extremely useful product. I could definitely use this. Imagine when we finally get to travel around, just having one power adapter with you. You don't need to bring any other charger. This will do it all. Ciao we go, people. Ciao we go. So here we have three top of the range cases by spec. This is their Presidio range for the Galaxy S21 series. One case for the S21 and we've got two cases for the Plus model. I'm just going to take one of them out to quickly show you what to expect. So it's designed for impact, drop tested, complete protection case with a very nice textured grippy finish on the back. So that's in blue. That's the new Presidio 2. You've got perfect clear and you've got perfect mist. So premium quality cases for your expensive smartphone, drop tested with a lifetime guarantee. Um, you can be rest assured that this is going to protect your smartphone. So the Presidio cases for the Galaxy S21 series. Now here we have the Govi Aura Smart Table Lamp. So we have over 20 different lighting effects. And there is also a smartphone app allowing you to customize the colors with special features like finger sketching, allowing you to draw a color design on your phone. You also have voice and app control. This supports Alexa and Google Assistant. And the lights can also automatically recognize and sync with any music you're playing. And the lights will change with the rhythm of the music. You can also set automatic timers for the lights to switch itself on or off. And here's a quick look at the control. So you want to turn the brightness down. You can just do it from the phone. 1%, 50%. Or check it back to 100. So Govi Light Studio where you can actually pick a color. So red, green, blue. And you've got a DIY section where you can save other users colors. So if we apply this one, you can see how the color changes. Or you can try this one here. Red fate. Or all color fade. So all sorts of customization options you have here. Now over here, you've got music, color and scene. So if we tap on music, oh, that's nice. You can vibrate, energetic, rhythm. So any sound it hears, including my own voice, it will start flashing. So I'm gonna play some music. I'm gonna try this out. So next up, we have a brand new electric bike called the Nubility B14. So this is a brand new fully foldable electric bike. It has a powerful 400 watt motor and will give you top speeds of up to 25 kilometers per hour and a massive range of up to 100 kilometers, depending on which mode you are in. So there are three speed modes. Mode one will give you 15 kilometers per hour tops. Mode two will give you 20 kilometers per hour and mode three will give you your top speed of 25 kilometers per hour. It's very well made, robust, completely foldable and it weighs around 21 kgs. You have 14 inch wheels and built in rear shock absorbers. So that means comfortable drive on all terrains. Now on the handlebar, you will find an LCD panel, which shows you your speed and battery information. And you have a separate switch to turn on and off your LEDs. So there is a front light and a rear brake light. Now charger port is located at the back and it does take around seven hours to fully charge that battery, but you can achieve up to a hundred kilometer range. So that's a pretty good battery life. Now there is a smartphone app which shows you your speed, mileage and gives you lots of custom options like sports mode, speed increase and decrease. So the app allows you to unlock the speed up to 35 kilometers per hour. Although that speed is not legal in the UK, I had no problem whizzing around at top speed um, with no questions asked. So the bike powers on when you turn the key and if you remove the key, the bike turns back off. So you do need the keys in order to operate the bike. Now there is an accelerator on the right handle and a digital horn on the left with your light switch. Now we have dual mechanical brakes front and back. However, this bike does not have any manual gear change. So when the battery does die, you'll be pedaling manually, but there'll be no gears to assist that pedaling. So good job, you have a hundred kilometer range. The maximum weight supported is 120 kgs. The drive is ever so smooth and the motor is actually quite silent in operation. You have a decent acceleration and the bike is not bad up hills thanks to the powerful 400 watt motor. 
As I begin my tests, it did start raining and snowing at the same time, but that did not hinder me from using this bike, as you do have an IP54 water resistance, so no worries about the bike getting drenched in the rain. So that was the Nubility B14 electric bike. Good experience so far. If anything changes, I will update you guys in a pinned comment. So there you have it guys, that concludes episode 53. I'll see you guys again next month with another episode showcasing some of the coolest tech that I set my eyes on. Now do let me know in the comments which products were your favorites from the bunch and all the links are provided for you in the description box so you can check out any of the products that you've just seen. That's all for this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a brilliant day. I'll see you guys the same time, same day next month for another episode of the Coolest Tech of the Month. I'll see you guys in the next one.